It's Friday, May 24th, the last Friday for the 2018-2019 school year. And the last Friday show as well, so let's get started. <laughs> Hello Lions, I'm Timothy Olivas. And I'm C. Chloe Jimenez. And this week is for the winners. I am so proud of all of the students that are sitting in this room right now. You've taken advantage of a wonderful opportunity with our STEAM week. Um, science, technology, engineering, art, and math. Those are the keys to future success. So what you've done here today is very important. And I'm also going to say that for continuation alternative high schools, you do not often see this level of enrichment in the math and sciences. So I'm very proud of all of the work that you have done. And I feel very fortunate to have a teacher of the caliber of Mrs. Valencia <laughs> organizing this kind of event for our school. She was just named the District Teacher of the Year. And this is a big part of that. The Vista STEAM competition produced a plethora of pretty pleased prize winners. Take a peek. We also had a win for our printing program. The program is a three-year program. Uh, see your counselor. Uh, presently, we offer a graphic production uh, one, graphic production two, which is an advanced class, and graphic production three, which is part of an internship pro program whereby you can earn an hourly wage. What the program offers the students is the opportunity to learn a skill and eventually be placed in a position in the industry. Uh, presently, right now, we placed our first student a few, a few months ago. Every year, the Printing Industry Association of America and the Rays Foundation honor the best graphic arts students in Southern California. This year, there are three contests, bookmark, coloring book, and packaging. The foundation had over 500 entries, and the LVHS took a first and second place in the bookmark open division. Manuel Beltran took first place and a $500 check, and Tyler France took second place and a $250 check. Congratulations to Mr. Sandoval and our two winners, Manuel and Tyler. And if you need some suggestions about what to do with the prize money, come see me after school. And finally, we have a new Academy Cup winner. Congratulations to... Ready, set, go! I'm Nicholas Anatino, and we have one more winner, and this is a big one. Here to tell us who the lucky winner is, please welcome Principal Leano. Good afternoon, Lions. This is Mrs. Leano. Welcome to the Principal's Perspective. It's time for our last fishbowl drawing of the year. 
Our staff has been busy catching students doing good stuff and putting their names into the fishbowl for a chance to win Knott's Berry Farm tickets. I'm very proud of all the students who have had their names put into the fishbowl each month. We have so many students making good choices and every one of them has received a front of the line pass for either the cafeteria or the bus. And of course, the big winner won Knott's Berry Farm tickets. Let's see who this month's winner is. This month's winner is Crystal Hoskins, and she was put into the fishbowl for getting all of her um, paperwork in and being part of the Fullerton Promise. She's going to go to college for free next year. So congratulations, Crystal. Come on down to my office. You're going to Knott's Berry Farm. All right, Lions, that's all for now. Keep making good choices, focusing on your goals and earning all your credits, and I'll see you next week with my newest installment of The Principal's Perspective. Let's take a look at what's coming up in our final days. This Monday, May 27th, is Memorial Day, and that's a no school day, so enjoy. Tuesday, May 28th, in the school library is Senior Breakfast. It starts at 9.30 a.m., don't be late. Also, on the 28th, say cheese. It's your last chance for senior pictures, and the sitting fee is free. And the 28th is also graduation rehearsal, and it's mandatory. Graduates will meet at 11.30 a.m. on the south side of the La Vista La Sierra High School parking lot. Do not be late. You'll also get your graduation tickets at rehearsal. Everyone gets 20 tickets for your family and guests, but only when you participate in the graduation rehearsal. Graduation. Graduation is Wednesday, May 29th, 6 p.m. at the Buena Park High School Stadium. Graduates must arrive by 5 p.m. and check at the Buena Park High School gym. And remember, no balloons, Graduation lays or strollers will be allowed, and flat shoes only. No heels allowed. Finally, for the rest of you, Thursday, May 30th, is the last day of school, and there is one last huge surprise for everyone who's on campus. You don't want to miss it. That's it, Lions. Thanks for watching. Please be safe and make good choices. And until next time, Lions, Roar on! We are the Lions! Oh!